It was New Year's Eve, December 31st, 2006. A celebration is what Lori Nordman had in mind, not a life-altering emergency. He was out here all day working. And had a scissor lift where I could stand up, just my head would just clear the ceiling, reach out of the scissor lift to take a measurement. Alone in his workshop, Lori's husband, Mike, fell nearly 20 feet, striking his head on a concrete floor. I came out here, I opened the door and walked in, and it was silent, there was no noise. And then I looked over and I saw him laying on the floor. And uh, my heart just sank to my toes. Mike had suffered a traumatic brain injury and nearly died. There was something inside of me that said, no, he's not going to die. He, he's not going to die. I wasn't going to let that happen. While Mike spent the next six months in rehab, Lori, a full-time nurse, mother of six, and grandmother of eight, drove herself to the brink of exhaustion, taking care of everyone except herself. I just kind of had a meltdown. At nearly 200 pounds, smoking two packs a day, on all sorts of medication, and 48 years old, Lori was at her wit's end. I felt terrible about myself. I didn't like the way I looked. I hated to see myself in the mirror. After the first time we weighed in and I lost like 17 pounds the first time. Then one day, Lori saw a news story about a woman who transformed herself at an Anytime Fitness Club just a few miles from Lori's home. I was worth everything that I'd worked for. Kind of thought, hmm, there's a gym close by and look what this woman did and, you know, maybe I need to go check that out. There we go, push from the front of your feet, on your toes. Encouraged and supported by her personal trainer, Mark Grubham. Come up slow. Lori began working out six times a week at the Anytime Fitness Club in Gretna, Nebraska. Let's go. A couple more. you got two more at least. Lori had tried other gyms before. Still digging deep. But with limited success. I tell people all the time, I go to Anytime Fitness in Gretna. And I have a wonderful trainer. <laughs> Within just two weeks, Lori completely quit smoking. Within seven months, she lost nearly 70 pounds, and she's no longer taking all of those prescription meds. By coming in here and getting in shape, um, I've been able to get off of blood pressure medication, cholesterol medication, uh, some of my allergy medications. Just changing her whole life around, uh, being able to actually go out and and you know do things with with kids and grandkids, and you know it's just given her so much more confidence. Being healthier and physically fit, I'm plan on keeping it this way. <laughs> We're not starting all over again. She's my soulmate. Heavy or thin, she's always been the girl I wanted to be with. As for Mike Nordman, he too is doing much better these days, thanks in large part, he says, to the strength he draws from Lori. She's the type of person that worries more about the grandkids and the kids and and me and the dog and the cat and than she does about herself. She never did celebrate New Year's Eve in 2006. Okay. You seriously should think about coming up to Anytime Fitness with me. But as she looks forward to the future, I'm the living proof. Lori knows she'll be celebrating for many more years to come. So since I lost all this weight, you know I'm just the Energizer Bunny. Yeah, I'm just the old tired fat guy.